and welcome to my workshop. Today I'll be talking through the five main types of wood and their uses. Softwood, hardwood, plywood, chipboard and MDF. So let's go! So this is softwood and this is a natural wood because you can see all the growth marks of where it's been growing and you can see these little holes and these are called knots where the branches came out and the main uses for softwood are door frames window frames and if you're generally building a wall so let's go on to the next one So the next one is hardwood and um, this is also a natural one because um, you can see all the growth lines and I've got a different version of it and this is loads of different bits of it um, just compacted and glued together and um, the, it's usually made, made for furniture because of its look and it's like nice and dark. So yeah, let's go on to the next one. So this next one is called plywood and that it's made up of sheets or sometimes known as veneers of wood all glued together and it gives it a lot of strength and it's good for like if you're doing wooden floor if you're having wooden floor in your house, um, these would be really good for it. So let's go on to the next one. So this next one is called chipboard and it's, most, it's the most used sheet of material in the whole world, which is mind blowing. And it's made by gluing loads of little bits of wood or sometimes known as chips because hence the name and um and it's very cheap and it's made out of flat and it's made mainly for flat pack furniture which is like if you go to ikea or somewhere and it's all in boxes and you have to assemble it yourself this is what it would be made out of so let's go on to the next one we have MDF which stands for medium density fiberboard and there are even more little bits than wood of wood even less smaller than chipboard and they're all compacted together and it's very cheap and it's very smooth as you can see and its main uses are for cabinets shelving and skirting all around your house so that's my presentation of the five main uses of wood see you next time